Midday Live, a live update from Santa Clara County on its coronavirus response. And U.S. stocks spiked this morning after one local company announced encouraging results for its experimental coronavirus treatment. Plus, how widespread COVID-19 has become in the Bay Area. The newly launched multi-million dollar Chan Zuckerberg initiative effort to find the answer. Midday Live is next. is about the people inside and making sure they have everything they need, like guaranteed replacement coverage and savings when you bundle auto and home. Triple A. Triple A Auto Insurance is about the people inside the car and making sure they have everything they need, like a Triple A membership with roadside assistance, local agents, and nationwide auto repair experts. Triple A. And this is a live look at the Santa Clara County Board of Supervisors Chambers in San Jose. We are waiting for Dr. Sarah Cody, the county's public health officer, to start a news conference with an update on the county's COVID-19 response. Now, when this news conference begins, we will bring it to you live right here on our website as well. That is abc7news.com. Looks like it'll be a few minutes. Good morning. I'm Kristen Z. I'm Reggie and Keith, thanks for being there today. Also, Marin County is expected to announce the details of its new shelter-in-place order today. County health officials didn't give specifics, but they said there will be some changes, including possibly easing some restrictions on lower-risk outdoor activities. That official announcement from Marin County is expected at noon. And starting today, people who live in Sonoma County will be able to walk or bike to some parks, which have been closed since March 23rd. Physical distancing guidelines still apply. Restrictions on construction, real estate, landscaping are also expected to be loosened. So we're definitely seeing a pattern here. Santa Cruz County could decide to close its beaches by the end of the week. It comes after crowds flocked to the area. As you know, it was a warm weekend. Santa Cruz police gave out 210 citations. Most of them were parking violations. This is how it looked yesterday. An announcement is expected to come with the county extending its shelter-in-place order. Right now, the shelter-in-place is supposed to be expiring May 3rd. This year's Sonoma County Fair has also been canceled. The decision comes after the county health officer restricted large gatherings through the end of summer. And we got an announcement this morning from Foster City-based Gilead Sciences raising hope in the battle against coronavirus. Now, the company says that its experimental antiviral drug from Dizavir has hit its goals in a government-sponsored international trial. According to the company, more than half of severely ill patients receiving five and 10-day dosing regimens were discharged from the hospital within two weeks of beginning the medication. It's important to note, this is a treatment for those already sick. This is not a vaccine. And this isn't the first study involving remdesivir. A previous study out of China showed inconclusive results. All right, and as you know, we are awaiting that announcement from Santa Clara County on the possible easing up of some restrictions given where the county stands right now in the fight against the coronavirus. And um, let's go ahead and listen in on this news conference. Um, and you all have